In this edition, we have Aaron Kinch here to give us a walkthrough on how to calibrate meters on a cedar with the 4600 Command Center. Hey guys, this is Aaron from Land Pro. Uh, today we're going to go over how to calibrate the meter rolls on an N530C. So first thing, go to your main menu, then go to the Seed Star button, and then to do the calibration we're doing, we have to turn the EPG on. So engage the PTO and then turn on your EPG, your electric power generation. And then go down to diagnostics and calibrations. And we're gonna to go to calibrations, meter calibration. And for this, we're gonna do it stationary. So we're gonna do the manual calibration. And here it's telling us that our EPG is on and ground speed must be zero. So we're gonna hit next. Then it's gonna ask us which section we wanna calibrate. And for this, we're gonna do section four, the right wing. And then it's gonna ask you to select the number of RPM or revolutions per minute for the calibration, which we're gonna leave it at the default. And now we're ready to walk back to the machine and do the calibration. The next step of the calibration is to zero our bag. So we turn our scale on and we're going to go into pounds and then zero it with the bag on it and now we're ready to attach the bag to the meter and do our calibration so we just walk over to the meter that we already opened so now we have our meter bag or catch bag attached to the meter housing and now we're going to push and hold this switch for two minutes and that will dispense seed into our bag and once the two minutes are up or 100 revolutions we will weigh the bag. So after it stops turning, um, go to put your bag on the scale and it looks like we got 16.84 pounds in ours. So now we go up to the cab and enter that into the calibration screen. So now we're back in the cab. The calibration is complete. You can tell by the green check mark. So we hit next, and then we type in our actual weight, and then it gives us our new meter calibration, and I will say this is a brand new drill that has not been calibrated at all until just now, so we're going to go through and do the rest of them afterwards. Now you know the process of calibrating your cedar. Follow and like our page on Facebook at Land Pro Equipments Precision Farming Division and check out our YouTube channel for more videos to get you ready for spring.